but you were not real about you calling me. Therefore, I didn't hear you because I don't hear a sinner. Come on, somebody. But I hear those that worship me and they that worship me was worship me in spirit and in truth. We don't have a problem worshiping him when the spirit is high, but it's outside of the house of God that we have the issue. It's when we are outside of the four walls of the thing that we call the temple of the church that we have a problem with worshiping the God that we serve. Because if we look at what we everybody today, we all look as if we got it going on or as if we are ready to meet Jesus when he comes. Amen. But the Lord said that I am a God that will not own the outward of appearance. Come on somebody. Because it is the outward appearance that he is deceiving. Y'all have been deceived by some folk they look good. Come on, somebody. They look one way, but if you get to know them, you will find out that they're not really the way that they look like. So you cannot be deceived by what they look like on the outward appearance. Amen. But you got to look at the very heart. For the Bible says that we are not supposed to know no man after the flesh. But he says, know them that labor among you. The reason I'm knowing you is not by how you but of measuring the spirit and the conduct in which you carry and conduct yourself in. So when we look at our church today, many people say that all I got to do is call on him and everything is going to be all right. So what Paul is dealing with with this church at Quran is that they are dealing with some issues that the foundation has already been laid for them. The foundation has already been laid and they know exactly what they are supposed to do. But when Somewhere down the line, some outsiders came in and decided to come against the very foundation that was already established in their life.